Good morning. Welcome to our safety training video, and we're going to show you how to handle a severe cut. So our first step in this situation is to make sure the scene is safe, and then we have our gloves on. We can see that our patient is bleeding. Blood. So first step after that is to grab a um, this pad <laughs> and stick it on the bleed with bleeding. Um, if it does bleed through the first one, you can add a second one to it. Ours is not, so we're good. Next, I want to check to make sure she has a pulse, which she's alive, so that's good. Um, can you wiggle your fingers, even if it hurts? Yeah. And then look away. What finger am I? What finger am I touching? My ring finger. Okay, good. From there, we can ask the patient to put some pressure on it for us. And we can take our gauze and we can start at the wrist and wrap it around. Can you move your hands back to the You want to keep the thumb and fingers out so that you can make sure it's not too tight and their fingers aren't turning blue because we don't want them to lose circulation. Um, pretty good. And then you want to, again, if you can, try to get a pulse and ask her to wiggle her fingers and what finger, look away. What finger am I touching? My point finger. <laughs> Good job. And from there, she can sit down. We had already called 911, so we can wait until 911 shows up. Okay. And that is how you handle a severe cut. Thank you.